My last book is The Paper Palace by Miranda Cowley Heller. And this is, would kind of fit your women's fiction beach read kind mm -hmm. of title. So we meet Eleanor, or Elle, when she has just made either the best or worst, but certainly the biggest decision of her life. She has snuck out the door, um, the back door of her, her family's summer cabin in the Cape, and she has cheated on her husband Peter with her oldest friend, Jonas. So then the book kind of goes over about the next 24 hours where she's kind of coming to terms with what they did and kind of deciding what she wants to happen next. And the narrative goes back and forth between the present and the past. So we learn about Eleanor, about her family, her very dysfunctional um, family. We learn the reasons why Eleanor and Jonas never got together. Um, we learn about her meeting her husband, Peter, about their life and their children and everything. And it becomes very clear, you know, she loves both of these men in different ways. You know, one of them is her present and one of them is her, her might have been. Right, so um, that 24 hour time period is all building up to her making a decision, which she does, and I'm not gonna tell you when she <laughs> chose. <laughs> um, but I think, you know, this book has gotten a lot of um, great reviews on Goodreads, and I think um, if you start reading it, you're gonna get drawn in to Ellen's, um, Elle's story, and you're gonna wanna find out for yourself what she decides. I also think it would make a really good book club title because there is so much to talk about because she does have a very dysfunctional family, um, the dangers of silence, um, and her decision. And not just her decision, but maybe even talking about your own reaction to that decision because my reaction surprised me. So anyway, I think um, if you like books like by Jodi Picoult or Emily Giffen or Ann Patchett where characters make choices where you know you have to you think about them after you finish the book, then I think this could be a you know, great summer um, beach read. So The Paper Palace by Miranda Cowley Heller.